Storybook Moments Children's Storybook Read Alouds. Please give this video a like if you enjoy it. And don't forget to subscribe for new stories. Thank you. Reading aloud to you The Lost Dinosaur Bone. A Little Critter's Book by Mercer Mayer. Our class went on a field trip to the Museum of Natural History. I couldn't wait to see the dinosaurs. When I grow up, I'm going to be a dinosaur hunter. But when we got to the museum, the dinosaur exhibit was closed. So we had to see the butterflies instead. The butterflies were fun, but I really wish we could see the dinosaurs. Next, we went to the rainforest. There were lots of trees with monkeys in them. Ooh, ooh, I said to the monkeys. A guard came running up to see the monkeys too. So I asked him about the dinosaurs. I found out that the exhibit was closed because a triceratops bone was missing. In the Hall of Gems and Minerals, it was very dark, so we had to wear mineral hats with lights on them. Tiger went looking for diamonds, but I was too busy looking for the missing dinosaur bone. No luck. After that, we went to the planetarium, where the ceiling turned into a sky filled with stars. We found out that the planet Mars is covered with dust, and that the planet Saturn has rings around it. I kept my eye out for the dinosaur bone, but I didn't see it. On our way to see a meteorite, I asked Miss Kitty if I could get a drink of water. When I found the fountain, I also found something else, the dinosaur exhibit. It had a big sign saying, Exhibit Closed. I went closer and saw a Tyrannosaurus Rex. It was heading right for me. I ran away as fast as I could and found myself face to face with a velociraptor. It had its mouth open wide so I could see all of its sharp pointy teeth. The guard told me the exhibit was closed because of the missing dinosaur bone. I know, I said. I've been looking for it everywhere. On my way out, I took a wrong turn. That's when I saw something long and white sticking out from under the Ankylosaurus skeleton. It was the missing dinosaur bone. I ran back to tell the guard. He didn't believe me at first, but when I showed the bone to him, he gave me this big smile. Then I told Miss Kitty, and the guard took our whole class to this special place where the scientists who study dinosaur bones work. Thank you for solving the mystery of the missing Triceratops bone, the scientist told me. The scientist took us on a tour of the dinosaur exhibit. They showed us a stegosaurus skeleton they had found buried in a mountain. I'm going to be a dinosaur hunter when I grow up, I said. You already are, answered the scientist. You know what I'm going to do tomorrow? Dig for dinosaur bones in my backyard. The end. I hope you enjoyed the book. For more stories read aloud, please don't forget to subscribe.
Thank you and have a lovely day.